Hello everyone, good to be with you. This is meteorologist Erica Rascaet at the One News Weather Center with your local weather report. Well, taking a look at the headlines, we are expecting some nice changes coming our way. Temperatures will remain above average throughout the next couple days. A chance of rain still tonight, especially across the inland northwest and southeast portions of Washington, and then a drying trend for the weekend thanks to high pressure that will regain control in the weather pattern. Conditions throughout the past 24 hours across Ephrata did reach into the mid 60s, those highs, definitely above average. And overnight lows were around where we should have been a bit chilly overnight than what we saw the night before. We saw some trace of precipitation, very light drizzle across the area and across the Columbia Basin. Conditions did remain dry and temperatures will continue to warm up throughout the next couple days. Mid 60s, spring is right around the corner. So here's what we can expect. Current conditions out there still showing temperatures in the lower 60s, mostly cloudy skies. Dew point levels still far from the temperature, so drawing trend all across. Winds already shifted from the northeast, very lightly though, between 5 and 10 miles per hour. So throughout the past 24 hours, here's what we saw. Abundant moisture still worked its way in. That low pressure system left some coastal showers, some rain even across the mountains. And even across the inland northwest, we did see some showers developing overnight and earlier throughout the afternoon today. So here's what we can expect throughout the next 24 to 36 hours. That low pressure system that left a few showers, a few disturbances still leaving a few rain and snow showers, and even some thunderstorms across the inland northwest and even across southeast portions of Washington. So some moisture also working its way in from Oregon towards central portions and even across the Cascades. But high pressure will slowly settle in from the Pacific and that's going to move inland throughout this weekend. Friday we can already expect an improvement as far as the conditions across most of the northwest. And across the inland northwest we'll still see some showers developing throughout the day on Friday and Friday night. But still we are expecting an improvement for the weekend. Then finally high pressure slowly works its way in completely leaving a much drier area throughout the day on Saturday and into most of the weekend. And then we're going to remain dry and mild temperatures until at least the next work week. So where the conditions throughout the day on Friday, partly to mostly cloudy skies, and we are expecting abundant sunshine across most of the Cascade, but then that clouds will turn into lots of sun, especially across all these portions of Washington where we could still see a few showers overnight. Friday, we are expecting that drying trend to continue, especially for us here across the Columbia Basin. Temperatures all across warming up back into the mid to upper 60s. A great weekend is in store for us with lots of sunshine and spring-like temperatures in store for us. So taking a look at the extended outlook, we could see a mix of sun and clouds throughout the next couple days, but then Saturday and Sunday, high pressure regains control of the weather pattern, leaving us with dry conditions and very comfortable temperatures, mild, should I say, in the mid to upper 60s. And that's going to last until at least the next work week as high pressure slowly continues to weaken, works away from the area. A few more clouds on Tuesday, then Wednesday and Thursday, chance of a few showers again as the next system comes through from the Pacific. Apart from that, dry, mild, and very pleasant weather. That's all for now at the moment, but we'll be right back with some sports.